Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're all doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 limited rewards video. In this video, we're going to take a look at uh, two outfits that you can unlock by playing Season 2 and by reaching rank 96 and 98. So that's uh, the outfit I'm wearing right now. So let's start wasting time and jump right into it. Alright, so as soon as you've played Season 2 and you've reached rank 96, you will unlock the Subjugator Mask, uh, which prevents damage and diseases from airborne hazards as well. And as soon as you've reached rank uh, 98, you will unlock the actual outfit as well. So once you have unlocked all that, uh, you will need to navigate to your uh, armor workbench, uh, click the craft menu section to craft the head aware so essentially you go to the head aware uh, section you scroll all the way down to the letter T until you find the subjugator you craft it done uh, afterwards the outfit same thing you scroll all the way down till T and that's gonna be the subjugator outfit you craft it done alright so let's uh, review the actual outfit to be honest uh, <coughs> it does look good but I prefer another outfit uh, to wear with the mask. Uh, by the way, there is an issue with the mask. I'll uh, go into it in a little bit in a little moment right here. So as you can see, the outfit is pretty okay. But I prefer wearing it with the um, the traveler outfit, uh, caravan traveler outfit from the Atomic Shop. I'll show it to you as well a little bit later on within this video. And uh, that's the helmet right there. So there is an issue with the helmet, uh, like as you can see there are no bulbs, none of that. So what I'm getting at is that whenever you use your pit boy it navigates and glows as if you're using a mining helmet. So I'm going to show you that right now. Let's take a look. But overall I think it's more than enough to understand that the outfit is pretty cool but I like the helmet to be, on to be honest more. <laughs> it kind of look cool, you gotta admit. It's a shame it doesn't really look good with the samurai outfit because the neck is sticking out. Otherwise, could have looked like a shredder. <laughs> Alright, let me show you what's wrong with the helmet. Alright, in order for me to show you what's wrong with the helmet, I will need to navigate... Uh, hold on a second, let me put my backpack on, otherwise I'm all wait. Uh, here, some, somewhere dark. Right? Well, first of all, in first person mode, this is how it's gonna look like, right? Now, if I turn on my Pip Boy, right? Uh, in reality, it should glow sort of like green style. Let me actually go into uh, the train station over there. It should be darker than at my own camp. So there you go. You see? So it it flashes as if it's uh, a mining helmet, right? So if you go like this, boom. You see? Now, you can see over here that there are no bulbs, the eyes are not glowing, so something is definitely wrong. And why I say that is, for instance, if I change my outfit, it's still the same. See? If I remove my uh, helmet, mask, boom. Now the flash, uh, the pip boy glows the correct way so there's definitely an issue with the light bulb or whatever I don't know with the helmet basically <laughs> and as I said that now if you by the way turn it on look Fit Boy still glows but if you turn it off and turn it back on boom so yeah <laughs> and yeah as I promised I wanted to show you how it looks like with this uh, with the Oh, come on, man. You cockroach. So, let me turn that off. And what we're looking at right now is the... Oh my god, it's just some people don't get it. Like, I invite when I can. I already mentioned that a trillion of times. So, there we go. Uh, the Caravan Trader outfit. As I mentioned, that is from the Atomic Shop. 
and it does look good with the actual mask I don't know I personally really like this combo I like the fair and stuff like that so there we go look at that you gotta admit that looks nice Alright Z-Clan and everybody else, I hope you found this video useful and if you did, you know the drill, don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody see those comments, nobody can read them, nobody can reply to them. So, if you want your comments to be read, feel free to leave your negative or positive feedbacks without swearing. And uh, people will see your comments and will be able to reply. So, once again, I hope you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you on the next one. By the way, if you want to join our uh, community, feel free to do so. The link is down in the video description to our Discord. If you need help, there is a tutorial video. Basically, all useful links are down in the video description. And once again, thanks all for watching. You all have a good one. I'll see you in, in the next one. Bye. From the ashes we rose into the future.